Hey there, folks! Ghost Amel is back from Trigonus Productions with another fine episode of One Gun Only. And this time we have a uh, really fun weapon to use, I must say. I just would like to make a few pointers. Yes, I do have an accent, and yes, I love it. So, if you don't really understand me, I'm sorry. Uh, when I tend to talk, I, I, I don't really bother with it. And it's done live, so I'm playing as I'm speaking, and you know how distracting it can be. Especially when you have to talk about different things. So, um, I hope you really enjoyed this episode, and uh, yeah, let's see what's gonna happen. Welcome back, and now we're playing... Slayer, normal Slayer, hell yeah, on the map called Countdown. And in this match, we'll be using the all-time favorite, the AR. Hell yeah! Back to auto weapons, people. Back to auto weapons. Now, unlike in Halo, unlike like in Halo 3, I should say, um, the assault rifle in Reach is uh, a deadly weapon if used correctly. For example. Combined with a beatdown, it can kill you pretty fast. But yeah, no using beatdowns for me, so I'll just uh, try and stay alive with this uh, auto rifle by my side. Considering the amount of people are gonna try to sword me, and he did. Well, you know, I can't beat that, right? So let's talk about the AR some more. Um, it's still the same 32 round clip, or I like people like to say magazine, which is uh, the proper term. Um, it still fires fairly uh, sprayable, you can say. Uh, I wouldn't call it spray and pray just yet, and, and not at this current state. But that's technically what you do anyway. Uh, burst firing. Uh, many people tell me, yeah, that's the way to go, man. Burst fire it, ghost, ghost fire it. But uh, I, I tend not to listen to that because when uh, <clears throat> these wonderful people come at you with a uh, uh, intent to beat down. <laughs> You don't really care, right? You just want to uh, get the kill, and um, I'm doing horribly this match. Uh, I'm doing this live, so uh, I'm not gonna pick my best match and uh, use it as a uh, as a tool. Uh, I will just you see see that that's how you work in an assault rifle. You just you just wait for people to come to you. Yeah, I, I will not be posting my best games. My my last game wasn't the best. I just played and posted the match on YouTube with my commentary, which. Uh, I really love it came out pretty nice but uh, generally speaking uh, I, I fired the AR all the way and uh, ugh, should have stayed a bit closer but that's alright um, and hope to get a kill um, most of the time um, I'll uh, maybe run behind the corner wait for him to come to me and whatnot but generally the same usage right and restraint, and restraint, and you see see that people come to you to get a beat down they don't understand that when you have a face full of lead coming right straight at you, you just don't do that. You just patiently, 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 patiently kill them like that. With slight strafing backwards. Now, a few games that I had beforehand uh, netted me running out of ammo with my favorite gun, which is the AR. So, uh, I try and run over the, the dead bodies more often since most of them carry the AR anyway. And, uh... That tends to work. Um, let's talk about this map, right? Last time we talked about um, uh, that map, uh, which is called Asylum. So this map, why not talk about um, this map? Uh, obviously, if you have noticed, this map is from uh, Pain, from the wonderful Mitch Saber mission. Sword guy, run away from the Saber mission, and. Um, uh, I can't say it's one of my favorite maps. I really can't. I really can't say that because uh, honestly, there's so many turns that camping is is like a uh, a holy grail here. Especially when you have something like a shotgun. <laughs> burst fire, uh, triple kill, tip, ah, double team. But um, yeah, this map has a lot of corners. It's really good for invisibility, but. Uh, since I'm not using armor abilities just yet, I'll be just uh, using the sprint as my default. Which I'm allowed to use, it's the only armor ability that will be used in combat. And 
we have our sword guy. Let's take him down. And we're not going to take him down. We will, yeah, yeah, we will take him down. Um, I guess he didn't notice that his shields were down. Or maybe he's just uh, not really good, right? Oh, well, considering I have five kills. <laughs> but yeah, I'm not super uber in this game. No, I'm not. And uh, I'm never stated I am. But uh, I do tend to get my lucky share of good games. And uh, Rumble Pit is, uh, as I said before, is not really my favorite map. But it'll have to do for now. Uh, game time. But it will have to do for now. Or it really will. Because uh, for now, I want to get it out of my way. So, oh! Oh, that was a good shot. Smart man. Um, uh, assists. Eh, no assists yet, right? So we have our friends here trying to kill me if you will. Oh, no he won't. Once again, underestimate the power of the AR. That's generally the, the trend with the older Halo players, and uh, as well as the newer Halo players. Uh, you will find uh, on a bunch of the net forums that uh, a lot of gamers really uh, are against the AR, and I am not one of them. No sorry. I am not one of those gamers. I enjoy every single weapon in this game to its potential, but, um, eh, you know, DMR here and there, like I said in the last episode, not really a, uh, iconic weapon for me, but, uh, I, I do use it, I do use it, uh, pistol is also another weapon that I can find really helpful sometimes, but I still, uh, shotgun, yep, killed me, I was running away from one guy towards the other, I don't know why I went away, uh, I guess, uh, I was a little uh, unsure what weapon that person had since he was moving quite fast. So let's just wait till the guys come out and arm and lock. Swipe up that kill. Get that guy's sword. This guy gonna run out of the arena. Gonna kill sword. Gonna finish up this guy. Gonna put some lead in the end. Ah! Run, 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 run. Ah! He caught me. Yep. So, um, still in the message about the machinima. No message about the machinima, and uh, it's perfectly fine. I don't mind. Double kill. Sweet. I'm not gonna get like Mike again. And uh, once again, I said I I'm not really hunting for uh, commendations or uh, things uh, lately. Um, once again, this is just the EDAR sword. We're gonna run. We're gonna run. We're gonna run because we don't want to die from that sword. Because we're not stupid. Oh! I really forgot about the recharge on the on the sprint and we got sorted. I'm not complaining. It was a fair kill on his part. But uh, <laughs> I really would like to see how you do this. we can. Ah! Killed me. Killed me. Oh, wonderful effect. Those floating hearts, huh? Um, uh, from what I read, AR has like 18 boats to hit, to kill or uh, somewhere in that uh, dome. It's gonna crouch a bit, it will come up, but they won't. Um, and everything else you can spray as you want, but... Uh, double, kill, double kill, sweet! When other people give you kills, that's really good, especially uh, when you have a weapon like AR. But you must remember that, it's, it's still uh, quote-unquote legitimate since I got the kill, right? Uh, we have a DMR here, we have a guy behind us. He will beat us down. I don't know what I was doing when running towards him, but um, I really thought he was going to run back. Uh, sometimes I predict really bad. So the score is 23-19, and I am not on top. But uh, as I always say, that uh, considering I'm not using... Uh, not using anything but one weapon it's and we're gonna finish him off, we're gonna finish him off. No we did not, but we did give that guy a kill. Sword. We're not gonna get that sword guy. No we won't. Oh, uh, and we're done with 25 to 20 me in the second place. Using only the AR. So you might not enjoy this or you might thought that it wasn't good, but Listen to this, I'm doing this for your enjoyment, and I, I really hope that uh, you appreciate what I'm doing. Um, I've got some couple of nasty comments on my uh, Machine Animation website, which I really think you should visit. Uh, 
There's a great bunch of machine emitters there, rising stars. Some people with extremely great amount of skill. Uh, one of those people can be called Arbiter 617. If you really want to get into the machinima field and you think that machinima.com is not the place to start at, I urge you to go to machinimation.com. It's machinimation.com. Visit amazing website, amazing staff. Um, I guess I've done my share of advertising, right? <laughs> uh, they have affiliate programs and whatnot. Um, come and visit them. Um, come visit me. PM me whatnot, please rate, subscribe. I enjoy doing these. Um, I'm doing this for you. Thank you. Ghost Mel out.